Hi everybody, welcome to our service today. Welcome to the month of June. It's great to have you with us and we are looking at the second part of God's being today. It's a big topic, we're looking at the three persons of the Trinity. Um, so bear with us and if you've got any questions about the sermon or anything you want to say or pick up on, you can come to church chat tomorrow night. It's one of the things we do through the week where we talk about church or other things. If you just want to come and share how you're doing, um, how things are for you at the moment, you're more than welcome to do that. Sometimes that's just all we do. It's church people chatting about perhaps church and about stuff going on with their life. So you want to come to that? It's tomorrow night at 7pm and the, it's on Zoom and we will have the details for you um, on Facebook. So keep your eye on that. If you're not on Facebook, get in touch, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you. Um, the other things going on through the week, Wednesday night live group at 8 o'clock. Uh, we're looking at the first letter of John. Uh, do come along to that. It's fantastic. Uh, thank you again to Barry and Eric. I really enjoyed it this week. Um, yeah, please, let me just encourage you to come along to that. If you don't want to come to it all, that's fine. But please do. It's a great way to stay in touch and to learn some songs and to learn about God's Word. Then on Thursday, <laughs> excuse me, Thursday morning at 10 o'clock, we're looking at 1 Peter, and we are continuing to look at that this week. So I think we're finishing chapter 1 this week. So if you want to come to that, it's just a Bible study. We just literally open up the Bible, uh, read the passage, and discuss it. Um, so yeah, so come along to that. It's great. Um, and as we know... Today is on Zoom. Uh, we've got a service at Zoom on, th on Zoom at three o'clock. Sorry, I can't cope in this heat. To me. I can't think straight. Um, but obviously, you're watching this. So if you couldn't make it to Zoom, we missed you. But we understand. We're not taking names. And also, on the third Sunday of June, I think it's the twentieth. We are meeting at Christchurch Pennington at 3 o'clock. Um, 3 o'clock at Christchurch Pennington, we will have a service. So do come along to that. Tell your friends. Um, bring a mask. Wash your hands. If you've got symptoms, stay at home. But that's what we're doing. So yeah, so come along to that. It'd be great to see you. And keep staying safe, please. Um, and we miss you but we want this to be over responsibly. And if you've got anything you want to talk about, get in touch another way. And just keep praying for the SVC leaders as we continue to monitor the situation. So, I think we're the notices. Um, but here we have a reading that we're going to look at. In the sermon, which I recorded just now, we talk about the joy, entering into the joy of your master. Um, because God, who is Father, Son and Holy Spirit, is a God of love and a God of blessedness and a God of happiness. He was completely blessed and happy in his own company before he created us. He didn't create us because he needed us. That's horrible. He created us because he wanted us to share in the joy that is God. And so I've picked this for these verses from Nehemiah chapter 8, verses 9 and 10. Let's hear God's word. And Nehemiah, who was governor, and Ezra, the priest and scribe, and the Levites, who taught the people, said to all the people, This day is holy to the Lord your God. Do not mourn or weep. For all your people wept, for all the people wept, as they heard the words of the law. Then he said to them, Go your way, eat the fat and drink wine, and send portions to anyone who has nothing to eat. For this day is holy to the Lord, and do not be grieved. 
for the joy of the Lord is your strength. The joy of the Lord is your strength. This is God's, the Lord's day is God's New Testament day where we remember that Christ gave his body and blood on the cross for us and on this day Christ raised him from the dead. He sent the Holy Spirit um, 40 days later and so this is a day of joy. Do not be grieved. The joy of the Lord is your strength. Let's worship God.